For any Xbox or PlayStation codes or cheap games on any platform, use the referral link in the description. It'll take you to G2A.com. Use the promo code CHEZ over there and you'll get yourself 3% cash back. For all No Identity merchandise, hats, hoodies and t-shirts, follow the link in the description down below to the No Identity Fan Fiber website. Hey guys, welcome to episode number 18 of the Arsenal Career Mode series here on FIFA 17. Things got very heated in the last episode. Not necessarily on the pitch, but most definitely in the transfer window. There's a lot going on right now, and we are very close to making two or three signings, both incoming and outgoing. We start today, though, with a game against Burnley in the Premier League. We will follow that up with the second leg of the uh, Football League Cup against West Ham, followed by Arsenal against Sunderland, or Sunderland against Arsenal, I guess, away from home against Sunderland in the FA Cup, and Watford at home in the Premier League. Very busy window, both on the field and off the field. But Burnley and West Ham today. Now, I'm not sure whether to start a first team against Burnley and then a weekend sign against West Ham and then a first team against Sunderland, or, you know, which way around to do this. I might start a mixture. Might, pardon me, I might start a mixture because it is only Burnley and I would like to get through to the Football League Cup final if I can. I would like to get through to the Football League Cup final if I can. Uh, I'll probably start a weaker side. Drop the video a like if you enjoy. Subscribe to the channel too to make sure you don't miss out on any more content. And let's go play Burnley. Looks like Chamberlain. Oh, she will dink it. Casper Dolberg, Casper Dolberg will get on the end of it. But... Oh, I thought it was going to go down there. Uh, pull off the back. There we go. Will Shear, 1 0. Great play. I love it when players do that. They're running with the defender and then they just back off at the last minute when the defender's committed to going towards goal. And then you are able. Is that a foul? Is that a penalty? No, corner for Arsenal in real life against Stoke. But a goal for Arsenal here on FIFA against Burnley. OK, apparently that wasn't a foul. We'll get it out here to Alex oxlade Chamberlain. And this surely will now be 2-0. Yes, always confident with the Ox. Nice finish, 2-0. We're uh, winning convincingly now here against Burnley. It's been more the most comfortable game we've played for a while, actually. See the run being made in the middle. Oh, it's a great ball. Oh, Cochrane, why have you stubbed at that? Why has he reached like that? I might, it might have just been me mistiming the shot. It's a great run, and the ball from Iwobi was perfect. It's just terrible attempted finish. He needed the back heel there, but got it nonetheless. Bullshit. Looking for Kaspar. There's a third. Kaspar Dolberg finally does something right. And scores for the first time in a few games. Arsenal 3, Burnley 0. This is much more simple for us. No. Why? Why? I clearly want to throw that over Walters and the defender to the free midfielder, the other side. And he's just... Look, I want to throw that there to Coquelin. And he's just thrown it straight there. Buzzing. 3-1. Fuck my life. And that's in there to Dolberg. Poke that through. Cochrane could return it to Dolberg. Has done Dolberg. Get it around the corner to Jack Wilshere. We have a fourth. That's disappointing from the keeper. But we've immediately gone up the other end and gotten a three-goal lead again. Two for Jack Wilshere. Good through ball. And Johnny Walters turns me. Safe. I'll do a deflection. There's. Corner for Burnley. We're still only in the 65th minute. It feels like this game's been going on forever. It's a, well, I was going to say it's a poor corner, but in the end it actually wasn't. Let's see Chamberlain to Ramsey with a 1-2. Ramsey on the burst away. Play that in front of Alex Iwobi, who could turn the defender and has done well. And will burst into that space. Burnley got Man United next. But we don't really care about that right now. We're trying to get maybe Jack Wilshere a hat-trick. Oh, crashing into the roof of the net. We have got Jack Wilshere a hat-trick. 5-1. What a finish, Jack. Who needs to replace Ozil when you can just play Jack Wilshere at Cam? What a finish! Bang! Pick that out, Tom Heaton. Chamberlain through the gap there to Cochrane to Casper Dolberg. Well, he's done brilliantly there, Casper Dolberg. Could be in for another assist, maybe. Pull this back, Cochrane. Ugh! What on earth was that? Here's Ramsey. Ping that over there, looking for the ox. He's brought it down well. Someone's ended up on the floor in the middle. It's Francis Coquelin. Here's Ramsey. Into Wilshere. Could be in for a fourth for him, but no, he's put that one wide. Well, every other shot he's had in this game has pretty much flown into the back of the net, but that one dragged past the post, but that will probably be the last chance on goal 
in the entire game? Maybe not. Maybe Ozil can get in. No, he's not going to. And that probably will be and is the full-time whistle. A 5-1 win at home against Burnley with Jack Wilshire picking up the match ball for a hat-trick. It's about time we scored some goals, wasn't it? Because I haven't been scoring very many recently. Right, let's head back to the transfer window. Right. Oh, scenes. Ronaldo is happy that he played. We had a transfer offer in for Hector Bellerin. Hector Bellerin. But the biggest scenes were for this. Kevin De Bruyne has accepted the contract. 30 million, £35 million pounds plus Meza Ozil. Kevin De Bruyne will join Arsenal Football Club. We have a new cam. We have a new cam. Uh, I'm going to stall on Di Maria still. And wait until the... Ra I'm going to Basically, what I'm going to do is I'm going to wait until the Ramsey deal is done. Because what my plan is... What my plan is... Is to bring Sergio Roberto from right back to centre mid. And then sign a new wing back. Oh, it's absolutely pissing it down at Stoke right now. But that means, unfortunately for Asensio... That his, t his spot in the first team is disappearing for the time being because, rather understandably, De Bruyne is going to go into the starting lineup. I think Asensio, I could play him wide left for now. I don't want to keep him at wide left, but until we make the decision as to who comes in to replace him, we will put him wide left. I'll put Wilshire on the bench. But Kevin De Bruyne is in. And we'll play, I'll play him against West Ham. De Bruyne is in and will play against West Ham. And that is the game we're going to next. Will the Ramsey deal go through before the West Ham game? That email may well be that. No, Manchester City are going to match the 35 million we asked for Aaron Ramsey. So the plan is, as I mentioned, to sell Aaron Ramsey, to bring Sergio Roberto from rotation right back to rotation centre mid, so that we then have the money to buy a winger and a right back and or left back. I do have a couple of other players, a couple of wing-backs on the transfer list. Gibbs Martinez is listed, as is Gabriel. No offers for Gabriel yet, which is interesting. May use him as make weight to perhaps try and get someone like Alessandro Florenzi on the cheap. And I am going to put... I am going to put Nacho Monreal on the, on the transfer list as well. Right, let's go and play West Ham in this second leg of the Football League Cup semi-final after a 1-1 draw in the first. Right, Liverpool 2-0 up against Leicester after their first leg. So the winner of this will probably play Liverpool in the uh, final. But for now, it's me versus West Ham for a spot in that final. And this is Kevin De Bruyne's debut at the club. And this is his first touch of the ball. Unfortunately, giving it away, but... That's kind of my fault. Oh, I held my breath there. I thought for a minute, I thought for a minute that was going to fly into the top corner. But it didn't. Good save by Adrian. Manzini into Sturridge. Oh, touch from Zabaleta. Back to Sturridge. Finished as well. Right, OK. West Ham 1, Arsenal 0. Not the start I needed. Not the start I needed at all. Great finish, though. Bollocks. Mark Casemiro. Oh. It's good football, but I'm not getting the ball to drop for me in the right places in front of... Goal! Laurent Koscielny arrives at the corner. We are level. Literally, <laughs> the timing of my sentence was perfect for Castelli to arrive and power that header in. Uh, we swapped Ozil and gave Manchester City £35 million for Kevin De Bruyne, Joshy boy. Did we sell someone else? Did we sell someone else? I feel like we sold someone else, but... Oh no, Ozil was just involved in the, in the deal, wasn't he? Like I said, I'll try, oh, probably should have committed to the finesse shot earlier than that. Get up, Alexandra. Casemiro into Lacazette. Great turn and the finish. Oh, comes off Jose Fonte's head and goes out for a corner. Oh, it's a poor delivery. Ten minutes to go to half time. 1 1. Nice number, Chaka. 
That was it. De Bruyne. Out to Granit Xhaka. Oh, Granit Xhaka. Never mind. Oh, De Bruyne can't react. Well up, Mustafi. Great header. Casemiro, turn on that. Find Kevin De Bruyne, who could maybe work some space. And let fly. Corner deflected off Kiate. Just trying to get better delivery in from Asensio this time, shall we? That is a better delivery. Koscielny again. Well, that one's gone well wide. Oh, great ball out to Andre Ayew. Pushing forward here. Lays it across to Marco Nautovic. They've gone across again. Save from Petr Cech. Very important save from Petr Cech. Oh, Piazza heads over the bar. Ramsey to De Bruyne. Yeah, over the top. Wasn't meant for Lacazette. Wasn't meant for Lamar. But never mind. Put that back. De Bruyne's there. Oh, what a ball! No, he's missed it! That through ball from De Bruyne, though. Wow! I was meant for Lamar. Lacazette was on side at least. Get back to Lamar here. I don't know where to go with it. I don't know where to go with it. Fuck. Into De Bruyne. Kevin. Kevin. Pull that back. Oh, it just won't quite find Casemiro. That's a great cross. Lanzini with the best chance that West Ham are going to get. To make it 2-1. Over the top there to Asensio. Can we make them instantaneously regret that miss? Maybe. Lacazette through there. Maybe. Lacazette! No, Adrian with a save. Top goalkeeping. Asensio with the whip. Underneath it is Lacazette? Yeah. Great shot, Alexandra. That was superb. Lanzini. Yes, Will Ship. Oh, what a great ball into Sofian Fagouli though. Check can only palm clear, but Irene can't get there. Goal kick. Nicely worked. This is a good move. Until Lacazette lost it, but he's won it back again. Jack, come on, you're better than that. That's a great ball in behind. Andre Ayu. It's Fagouli. Saved by Check. Oh dear. Oh, no, it's going to drop free to Aaron Cresswell. Lamar blocks. Counter, 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 counter. Just notice that they've got no one up from the halfway line. Going the other way. Lacazette, please. No, Bonner's going to have the stamina, so I'm going to have to turn back. De Bruyne is... Oh, wow, what a chop from Angelo Bonner. Christ alive. Squeeze that through there to Tomar Lamar, who's in behind. Lamar to win it. 117th minute. Tomar Lamar buries that into the bottom corner. We're going through to the final of the Football League Cup, thanks to Toma Lamar. Great finish. Just as Fluffy, the Arsenal fan, arrives in chat, we get the second goal to guarantee ourselves a spot at Wembley. Oh, it's a great cross. Staffy heads away. Yes, blow your final whistle, ref. We're going to Wembley, boys. We are going to Wembley. West Ham took us all the way to the very end of the two legs, but we are going to Wembley. Two goals to one, three goals to two. We're in our first cup final as Arsenal manager. Three emails as well as we come back. Ramsey sold. Ramsey sold to Manchester City for 35 million. Granite Jack is only out for nine days, thankfully. But no less, yes, I know, you're unhappy. Right, now Di Maria is the only option we have left that outstanding. For the wide roll. So we now need to buy. How much money have we got? Oh, a lot. I've got. I've got 90 million. I've got 90 million to sign a winger and a wing back. Now I'm going to go for Florenzi. And what I'm actually going to do is try and use another player as well, to try and sweeten the deal. Stoke have just gone 1-0 up. Hesse's just scored against Arsenal. Yes, Hesse! Love that. Love that. Gibbs plus 10 million for Alessandro Florenzi. And I'm going to go for Marcelo as well. I think Marcelo would be great. And you don't see people sign Marcelo a lot on YouTube. Let's say Gabriel plus... 
25 million for Marcelo. It's a great finish from Hesse as well. Uh, let's bid for Jordi Alba too. I'll use Nacho Monreal as make weight in this one. Plus 25 million. And I'll also bid for Alexandra. All the bids flying in. All the bids flying in. Then once we've got our, w our wing back in, we know how much money we're going to have to go after a... Uh, a winger, a forward winger. Right, so all those bids have gone in. And let's now advance towards that game at the weekend against Sunderland in the FA Cup. Ramsey's gone, match rescheduled. That'll be because of the uh, final. Barcelona have accepted the bid for Jordi Alba of 25 million plus Nacho Monreal. Well, that was pretty simple. That was pretty simple indeed. I probably would have pitched Jordi Alba as well as my favourite from that lot. Juventus is unacceptable. They're not interested in uh, Lucas Perez. Not to worry. How about in Kieran Gibbs? I mean, Jordi Alba is the one that I would have wanted. And Jordi Alba has accepted. They're not interested in Gabriel. So I'll offer them Lucas Perez. And actually a little bit less money. I think Jordi Alba followed by Marcelo would be my preferred. And they are interested in Gibbs, but they want a little bit more money for Florenzi. Now, Florenzi, I'd like to get in as well as Jordi Alba, if possible. And the batch has been rescheduled. When is when is the final? Let's have a quick look, shall we? The final is against Liverpool after we play Liverpool in the league at the end of February. Scenes. We play Liverpool twice in a week. Right, let's advance. Things are... Warming up now in the transfer window. Jordi Alba contract offer accepted. Thank you very much. Jordi Alba is in. We have a new left back. We have a brand new left back. So I don't need you. Uh, transfer for Gabriel. Interesting. Hang on. Let me just see. Who did I offer Romo? They are interested in Gibbs. Okay. They're interested in Gibbs. So I'll say 17 million there. I'll counter offer for Gabriel. That will raise some extra money. And then we'll know exactly what we've got left. We'll know exactly what we've got left for um, a winger. So an offer for Gabriel. I'll counter off a 15 there. If they could give me 15 for Gabriel, I'd be quite happy to take that. Just to get him off the uh, off the wage bill. Because we haven't had any interest in him, really. I could use Gabriel as make weight in another deal. But you tend to end up paying a little bit more for the player if you do that. They tend to not really be that keen on straight swaps. But Jordi Alba is in. That deal is done. Uh... Roma offer accepted. 17. Please tell me you're going to... Oh, they're offering me... I'm going to accept that. Just to make sure we get him out the door. Because I'm, I'm going to need that money to buy a decent winger. Roma offer accepted. Alessandro Florenzi looks like he's going to come in as well. That would be great. Ah, oh, say important first team player. Because I, mean, I kind of want to keep Bayerin as right back. In my first team. Belgium international job offer. No, thank you. Don't want to manage the international uh, level. And then... Can we advance one more day? No, we can't. Well, that was where we will leave it for now then. Thank you very much for watching. Drop the video a like if you enjoyed. Subscribe to the channel too to make sure you don't miss out on any more on YouTube. And uh, we will play the final games in the next episode and end the transfer window. Thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't. Follow me on Twitch. Link down below. Follow me on Twitter. Link down below. I'll see you next time.